and welcome back to my channel. Today's tutorial is a Valentine's Day inspired tutorial. It's very pretty and pink and perfect Valentine's Day. So I'm just going to start by clipping my hair back with a headband and getting it out of my face just so it's much easier to do my makeup. I'm then just going to take this tea tree concealer from the body shop and I'm just going to put this on my acne and any other problematic areas I have on my face. At the moment I'm breaking out real bad so it's perfect for this. I'm then going to take my Bobbi Brown foundation and a flat top brush and I'm just going to buff that into my skin. After applying my foundation, I'm then going to go in with a beauty blender and I'm going to take the Pro Long Wear Concealer by MAC and I'm just going to apply that underneath my eyes and anywhere else on my face that needs a little bit of extra coverage. After blending that in, I'm going to take the LA Girl Pro Conceal and I'm just going to put that underneath my eyes, on my chin, and down my nose and other places on my face where I think they need to be highlighted and then blend that in with a beauty blender. I'm now going to take a Real Techniques brush and the MAC Studio Fix powder and I'm just going to set that all down. To set underneath my eyes I'm going to take the Scarlet Translucent powder and go in with that same Real Techniques brush that I just used before. I'm now just going to take my Bobbi Brown bronzer and a big fluffy bronzing brush and I'm just going to bronze up my face and give my face a bit more colour and dimension. Taking the e.l.f. eyebrow kit in the shade Dark, I am now just going to take an angled eyebrow brush and fill in my eyebrows. I'm now just going to run through my eyebrows with a spoolie. Now moving on to the eyes, I'm going to take the Maybelline Colour Tattoo in this pinky champagne colour and I'm just going to pop that all over my lid as a base for my eyeshadow. Now taking this palette by Chi Chi, I'm going to take the really, really light pink colour and I'm just going to pop that in the inner corners of my eyes, dragging up to the first third of my eyes. After doing that, I'm going to tape the sides of my eyes so that it makes it so much easier to create a defined line with my eyeshadow. I'm now just going to take the Australis Double Decker eyeshadow and I'm just going to take the bottom colour and place that all over my lid. I'm now going to go on with a big fluffy brush and this Chi Chi palette and take that brown colour and I'm just going to sweep that through my crease. I'm now going to take another big blending brush and I'm going to take these two colours here and blend that into my crease. I'm now going to take this eyeshadow by L'Oreal and it's just really pretty in pink and I'm going to place that all over my lid. Just to add some more depth and make my crease a bit more matte, I'm going to take the e.l.f. eyebrow kit in dark but take the powder side and just buff that into my crease. 
The eyeliner I'm going to be using today is the MAC Long Lasting Eyeliner and I'm just going to be placing that along my lid and then also wing it out by using the tape as a guideline. Yes, I know I had a little moment here where I messed up my eyeliner, but you know the drill, just leave it until it dries and then remove it with a cotton tip. After doing that, I just removed the tape. Taking this brush here and the Maybelline Master Highlight Blush, I'm just going to apply this to the apples of my cheeks to make this look even girlier and prettier. Using the L'Oreal Gelmatic Eyeliner, I am going to now line my waterline. To highlight my face, I'm going to use the MAC Sparkling Rose. It is so pretty and pink and I think it is a perfect highlighter for this look. So I'm just going to dust it across my cheekbones. The two mascaras I'm going to be using today are the Maybelline Great Lash and the Jordana Best Lash Extreme. And I'm just going to be applying the Maybelline to my bottom lashes and the Jordana to my top lashes. I'm now just going to apply some falsies here. I'm just waiting for the lash glue to get a bit tacky. That way it is way easier to apply them. For my lips, I'm going to be taking the Maybelline Color Whisper and Ravishing Pink and I'm just going to put that on my lips. So this is the completed look. I really hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. I know I loved filming it. I think it's so pretty and pink and perfect for Valentine's Day. I hope you all have an amazing Valentine's Day and I will see you all very soon. Bye!